Hello, welcome back to Tales of Berseria, where last time we met up with uh, Rokuro's brother, Shigure, who was an ass. And then Kuragane, a swordsmith, went and made a couple of swords for Rokuro, which was nice of him. And then Exorcist uh, ambushed us, and then we promptly killed them. And now, if I remember correctly, we have to face Shigure at the port, and I'm not happy about that. I'm not even sure I'm going the right way. I'm probably not. Hello. Ooh, can I go across there? <sighs> I keep trying, but I never can. Maybe if I press the right button. Hello. Uh, but okay. Maybe there's a reason for that. <sighs> there's nothing to pick up. Okay, getting warmer, I think. Hello. Let me through! Hmm. That's a new door. What is the point? What is the point? This isn't even a, a this isn't even a puzzle. You just like put a roadblock here. But just made an easy way to go around. What's... I don't get this game. <laughs> oh, and a cat's box. Uh, oops. How much do I need? I have currently 342. I can spare some cats. Souls. <gasps> Rosy cheeks. Neat. Alright. Hey, Rokuro. Why did he call your storm howl a reject? Well, you see, when blacksmiths make swords, they don't just make one at a time. They make a whole bunch. The best one of them all is the one that gets presented to the swords commissioner, while the rest are tossed aside. Huh. I didn't realize the standards were so high. The head of my clan gets the real Storm Howl, and his siblings get the remainders. So one is real, and the others are imitations? I guess so. Shigure has the real one, and... Yeah, guess that makes mine an imitation. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to imply... Don't apologize. You got me to finally realize something. It might just be why I'm so hung up on beating him. Oh. And to Velvet? Which Lafayette said is real, and which is the imitation? Oh. What are you saying? She means my name. It's the same as Velvet's brother's. Huh? The one who went and got sacrificed by Artorius. Surely you are mistaken. Our shepherd would never do such a thing. But what else could make Velvet hate Artorius so much? I... I don't... So you have a truth, and Velvet has a truth. Now which is the real one, and which is the imitation? Uh, uh... My conversation went south, courtesy of Magulu. I also did not notice that I have an expedition to check on. Ooh, I level up. Oh, new place! Oh, new skills! No, I want to explore the new place. Yeah! Oh my god, it's a dangerous encounter. That wasn't my intention. Oh god, it's a giant rock thing! It must die! You are in my way! Uh, I'm running out of souls. Charging! Don't think so! You may be a dangerous encounter, but I am stronger than you! Ow. No, stop. No, stop, please. Did I just auto guard? Maybe I should start moving the camera around. Aha! That actually hit. Some dangerous encounter you are. Maybe that means I'm doing the right thing. I might actually be able to defeat Shigure. If I'm this powerful to defeat a dangerous encounter so quickly. Whoa, how'd I get into... Was I already in Break Soul? I thought I already did my combo finisher. Whoa! No! 
Eleanor! It's Guardian. You officially win the award for the most useless... Like, for the most pointless use of a Mystic Art ever. That thing was almost dead. Just a couple of hits and would have died. Why did you do that? I don't have anything yet that brings back BG, so you just wasted a crap ton of BG for no reason. Oh my god, it just keeps going. Oh, but I have made progress. So let's see where this leads. Oh, it's another door. Oh, what kind of puzzle do you have for me now? Hmm. And a capsule. Right. It's a hole. It's not a hole. Never mind. Let's see what's around here. Okay, now we have a hole. Uh, and a bronze chest. Is this the way around? <gasps> Another hole. So many cross spaces. Okay. That was a little bit more intricate than last time, but still. Give me a challenging puzzle, please. Come with all these gameplay mechanics and you don't use them. Some more castles. Thank you. Let's go left and straight. Now oh, picking up another castle. Sorry, I'm way too powerful for you. You and Shigure both use the Rangetsu style. But to me, it looked like you both fight completely differently. Why is that? Our school encompasses two distinct forms. To the outside world, we're known for fighting with a single great sword. But we also study dual short swords should need arise. So, Shigure uses the great sword, and you use the short. In most schools, wouldn't the secondary technique be used primarily in support of the first? That's true for us as well. We learned the dual short swords to provide sparring partners for those studying the great sword. Then why would you handicap yourself against Lord Shigure? He's no mere swordsman. As I'm painfully aware, Shigure is a true master. We trained together since we were small children. I was his sparring partner for ten years. <sighs> his skill with the great sword is godlike. So, in order to beat him, I took up the short blades. To our school, it might be secondary, but it's what I know best. You're badly disadvantaged in reach. If I eliminate my fear, I have a chance. If I can control the terror of being split in half and I can step inside his guard, he'll have two times the trouble. Eliminating fear, huh? The style for someone who's lost his humanity. Right? It's like you two brothers are the very swords you carry. Huh? Stormhowl, a godlike sword known to all as the strongest there ever was. Storm Quell, burdened by the ceaseless struggle to best the other. One, an exorcist who walks in the light. One, a demon moving through the shadows. The only thing these two polar opposites want is to cut down the other. Precisely! Both are renowned blades, but I don't see what exorcists and demons have to do with it. Huh. I'm sure we'll find out. Madame Eleanor, who still doesn't know how to use her mystic art correctly, good god. No, I am just fine. I'm ready for this. <laughs> it's okay as long as it's not a dangerous encounter. What the heck? S <laughs> uh, no, stop. Uh, let's uh, switch to the zombie, because the zombie is the bigger problem. Please die. I think the zombie's more susceptible to ow, more susceptible to elemental damage. That would make sense. Ooh, I got another soul. Let's use it. Haha! -ha. Well, that missed. Come on, there you go. Hey, is everyone all right? Yeah, we're all fine. Onward. 
Yeah! We have an exit now. Let's not fight any of the zombies. Hmm. That's a pretty big door. I thought the lights were something else. <laughs> Let's save! Saving! Ah, <sighs> Shigure's out here, isn't he? Uh, Alright, let's do this. Or not. Never mind. Oh, my worries for no reason. To the star. Hmm. Never mind, he was out there. There they are. Which must mean they took out every one of the exorcists who went after them. Hey, I told them not to bother. Now how did that sword of yours turn out? <laughs> Fine, I'll find out by myself. Rokuro, we can handle the exorcists. Go and find your victory. Thanks. All right. Let's get down to business. Okay. You better not die too quickly on me. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Come on, bro. Don't hold back. Oh man. I'm slowed. That's not good. Let's just charge up. I'm good. Oh, cool. I got some more souls back. Now let's take care of these exorcists. Sweet. That's one down. This one's trying to cast the darts. Whoa! I died. Oh, God. Uh, lobby set. A little assistance, please. Okay. Oh. Did it die? Well, all right then. Oh no, leave him alone. Yeah. And uh, combo finish. Oh jeez. No, 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 Velvet. Velvet, I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. Velvet. Gosh, have half a brain, please. Oh, thank you. Oh no! Oh my god! Oh the pain! Oh it's way less than I thought it would be but still terrifying. Oh leave me alone. Oh! The wrong buttons again! Ooh, I need to remember it's the start button not the Y button. Alright. I still have three. Oh now I have four souls! Perfect! Let's make quick work of him. <laughs> Not as hard as you, th or as I thought you would be. Guard. Jeez, what is he charging? Hopefully, it's not another Mystic Art. Oh, jeez. Oh, I don't think so. Thank you. Whoa, what? No, that is. You put up a good fight, I'll give you that. But you're a frickin' demon. Shouldn't you bring more to the table than pretty damn good Rangetsu style? You don't have what it takes to win against the rightful heir. Don't count me out. Just yet. I've got something to show you! Take this! <laughs> now that was clever! Giving up one of your own hands to go for my neck! If I was just a second slower, I'd be dead now. I like it. 
This is what I've been looking for. All right, let's call it good here. Listen up! If you all want any hope of beating me, come find me once you're more skilled and better armed. <sighs> I'll cut you down. No matter how many times I lose. No matter how many years it takes. There we go. That's the face I'm looking for. So vicious. It's perfect. <laughs> what is wrong with him? Shouldn't you be worrying more about your own skin? The entire Abbey knows by now that you're a traitor. Uh, that guy, he was really strong. Yeah, he was. They all are. But we will beat him if we must. No matter what it takes. <sighs> the Von Elty is here. Let's get going. Please, take me with you. I'll make a sword that surpasses Storm Howl yet. I know I will. But for another blade to beat Storm Howl, its wielder must be a swordsman of unmatched skill. Hey, Eisen. Got any room on this pile of wood scrap for a suit of armor? If not, make someone wear it. <laughs> Works for me. You heard him, Kurogane. Many thanks. Okay, we're off to find Grimoire and decipher the book. You know where we're going, right, kiddo? Yeah. We're headed for the Isalt Archipelago in South Gand. That sounds like a fun place. Oh, everyone except for me leveled up. Oh well. What are we at now? Oh no, I did level up. Look at me go. Oh, and a skit. Velvet's demon hand. It's such a mysterious weapon. I can only imagine how much of a threat it will become to the Abbey. This calls for a clear-headed breakdown of everything I know about it so far. It changes shape in a flash, and could devour most anything. How must that feel, to devour something with your hand like that? But it doesn't devour the bandages that cover it up. Maybe they're protected with some sort of special art? Likewise, the rest of her outfit can't be ignored. One would think she wouldn't want to wear such ragged clothing, yet she clearly has no inclination of buying something new. I suppose that could be taken to mean she has some sort of attachment to it. But that top is really big for her. Like it was made for a man! Maybe she wears that outfit in memory of someone important to her. I'd better not touch it then. I know I may not look it, but I really am good at sewing. Maybe I should suggest mending her clothes rather than outright replacing them. On the other hand, that fabric looks like it would be hard to push a needle through. I could be in over my head. But the tougher the fight, the more I get fired up! Of course, Lord Artorius would probably scold me if he heard me talking like that. Who'd scold you for what now? Oh, uh, well, I was thinking about sewing! I mean, your clothes, they're all beat up, and I thought that if I offered to mend them for you, you'd probably scold me, wouldn't you? You'd mend my clothes? Have they been worrying you that much? I mean, not like constantly or anything. It just crosses my mind from time to time. Are you good at it? Yes. I'm told I come across as awkward sometimes, but if nothing else, I'm good with my hands. I see. All right. If I ever need it done, I'll come to you. Good. Just leave it to me. Are you feeling all right? You're really sweating. The heat and the cold doesn't bother me at all. But you're a human. So you need to take care of yourself. And if you keep soaking in your own sweat, you'll catch a cold. Besides, I don't imagine it feels that great. You should keep washing and bathing on your own schedule, like however you did before falling in with us. 
Just let me know and I'll make it work. Because the guys aren't considerate enough to stop and ask you if you need to. Sure. Alright. Thanks. That was a surprisingly normal thing for her to say. I probably shouldn't bother with her clothes for now. We girls have to be considerate of each other. Eleanor is slowly starting to realize that we're not all the same. Slash thrust pop! Who wants to play a game? Ooh, I do. Play Chambloon. Chambloon. Two. Ooh. Play slash beat. Ooh. Help. Chambloon two. Select a challenger and see how quickly you can break all the balloons that appear. Ooh. Done that. Select a challenger and try to do as much damage as possible within the time limit. Haven't I already done that too? All right, we'll get Chambloon 2 a try. Let's try with just Velvet. I'm more familiar with her attacks anyways. Oh, it's starting, okay. That was quick. Jeez. Okay. Come on, really? Was that it? Okay, let's try the next one. Well, shut up. Alright. I like how it has a little toy sword, even though it's not going to attack me. Ah! Come on. Ah, oh, I can't do the Mystic Art. Oh, cool. Oh, shut up. Oh, cool. B rank. You came in ninth place. Not too shabby. Take this as a reward. Meow. Water normal suit. Ooh, velvet. Cool. Water Norman. Wait, water Norman. Norman? We have Norman clothes? Is it in fashion? Oh, it is. Oh, I'm a Norman. I am a Norman. Cool. I'm now a Norman. This isn't weird. To oh my god, it makes squeaking noises. Oh, this is adorable as hell. Oh my god. Alright, time to talk to my friends. Hey guys, I'm just normal every day. What am I, like 5 foot 10 or something, Norman? Oh, you're not a friend of mine. What's up? Hey, you there. That's one impressive sword you got. You know a lot about swords? I'm a novice swordsmith. Been at it for 20 years. Now I'm finally able to make a blade worthy of the name. 20 years? And still just a novice? It's a competitive world out there for a swordsmith. Especially here on this island. But I heard many swordsmiths have given up. There's less ore around nowadays and swords don't work against the demons. True, swords are useless against demons. Unless it's an exorcist that's using them. Kednick's weaponry has always been prized in Midgant. The Abbey recognized our talents, and now, business is booming. All the smiths here are grateful to the Abbey. They're keeping all of us alive and fed. I guess there's other methods to get DLC cost or DLC costumes, get costumes other than DLC. Why do I have a bandage? Is this just like the normal bandage that she wears? It's so weird. But it's so amazing at the same time. Hello. So, you guys made it. Whatever happened to that sword breaker? He's been dealt with. What are you doing here? After everything you said to me, I had a change of heart. I quit banditry. Thank you. I'm glad you listened to reason. What do you plan on doing from here on out? I'm heading to the capital. I plan on opening a restaurant for bandit cuisine. Bandit cuisine? Yeah. You get your hands on all sorts of food as a bandit. You gotta use what you have, and still make a tasty meal. Like a wild mushroom omelet, minus the eggs. Or highwayman stew. It's like a hunter's stew, but, you know, made by bandits. That sounds... somewhat improper, actually. But I'd still love to visit after you open. Really? All right. <laughs> I'll be an upright citizen in no time. <laughs> Maybe even the kind of man you'd consider spending some time with. I'm rooting for you. Hey. Were you actually listening to him? Of course I was. It's wonderful he's turned over a new leaf. Uh. Alright. Do we have another friend? 
Uh, it's, no, it's not a friend. It's just a pirate. Eisen, I thought you were supposed to be in Midgand. How did you end up here in Islegand? I thought I'd gotten used to you performing the impossible, but this time, I'm at a loss for words. We heard from the Bloodwings that the Abbey might have taken you guys out. Not this time, but our luck won't last forever. Think of this as a dry run for when I really kick the bucket. Aye, aye, first mate. More importantly, are you sure it's okay to bring an exorcist aboard? I've got my eye on her. If she does anything funny, I'll handle it. Got it! We'll be on our guard, too. Huh. Okay, so I just talked to... Uh, what was his name? Bitwit or something? Uh, and then we board the ship! But, until then... I'm just gonna save and call it a day. Thank you for watching. Please remember to like, favorite, comment, and subscribe. Ooh, an item. There's a little bell next to subscribe button. If you click it, you'll be notified of all my future uploads. Ooh, and there's a cat. Can I mess with the cat? I can't mess with the cat. Aw. I thought I would like my costume. Oh, but there's a place. I'm getting distracted. Anyways, uh, wait. Insight's technically over. Okay. And a bronze chest. Would you give me <gasps> a life bottle? Neat. I need that. Thank you. Chest. All right. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.